It's just really pleasant outside. Satellite view shows off just mainly a clear canvas here across the valley in through the foothills. And of course, we just saw that beautiful shot from Lake Tahoe. The one area we still have those low clouds is going to be right along the coast and expanding as well into parts of even Solano County this morning. So looking up around those coastal hills, you will see some of that marine there, but notice it's not working its way into Sacramento County like it did yesterday. While our skies are crystal clear right now in the mountains, I do expect that 10 o'clock we'll see a few high clouds and upper 50s in the Sierra. Then that forecast changes and it could be pretty abrupt if you have any outdoor recreational plans beyond noontime. There is a chance for a few isolated thunderstorms to pop up and blossom. Even in the Truckee and Tahoe Basin, I think the better chance, though, will be up and through the Plumas County area. Weather system is just too close for comfort. That'll continue to bring us some moisture to the mountains. And even tomorrow, this system could bring more widespread active weather to the Sierra. But the system has been really holding its ground to help keep re-increasing that onshore flow and keep our temperatures warm but not above the average. I still expect today will fall shy of average. We get back to average tomorrow. Then high pressure really starts to work in and look at this. It's right on top of us and it is strengthening as we get into the weekend. So that is going to usher in some very hot conditions, especially through this weekend. And for a lot of folks treating it like a holiday weekend in anticipation of the 4th of July next Tuesday. Today in the Sierra plan for those highs getting into the upper 60s, low 70s, areas like Auburn 84, Placerville 81, Jackson going to be a little warmer today at 84 degrees. Across the San Joaquin Valley, excuse me, across the coastal hills, looking at 85 in Fairfield, Conquer goes up to 83, and here we go. San Joaquin Valley, I've got you covered. Stockton looking at 89, Manteca 86, Modesto is going to be a little warmer today as you'll inch close to the 90 degree mark. And I think of many areas like Yuba City, Woodland and Roseville will likely reach the 90 degree mark and we'll hit 87 in Davis and Backville as you're a little close to that comfort of a bit of that Delta breeze. By tomorrow, we're back to average at 92. We go above the average on Thursday. That's going to be really a transition day. I think everybody's going to be starting